My name is Daniel Pink. I'm the author of a book called Drive, The Surprising Truth About What Motivates Us. And this book takes a look at 50 years of research in behavioral science, which says that a lot of the motivational mechanisms we're using in organizations today are kind of outdated. Only 20% of the workforce here in the UK says they're engaged on, on their job. Similar kinds of numbers in the US. We should be alarmed by that. And when you investigate why that is, I think it's because we're running an operating system for motivation that is archaic. What's exciting is that there's a rich body of social science pointing us to a very different direction of how to do things much more effectively. We've always been relying on what I call these if-then rewards. If you do this, then you get that. These carrot and stick rewards. They're pretty easy to do. If you do something great, I'll give you 5,000 quid. Now I'm gonna go back to my office and answer some email. How do I find out what really motivates you? How do I give you a sense of self-direction? How do I put you in positions where you make progress and, and I give you ample feedback on that? How do I understand what you're most interested in accomplishing? How do I bring in the why of what you're doing, not only just the how? That's very hard work. And I think people don't know how to do it very well. And one of the things that I'm trying to do is help people come up with the tools and the mechanisms to bring this new approach into their workplaces. I think CIPD has been an amazing partner on this because CIPD here in the UK is just at the white hot center of talent. New thinking on talent, new approaches to talent. And they're such a powerful organization and so muscular in the way that they do things. That I think they have a really great opportunity to take these ideas, help put them in place in organizations, and lead a transformation that, is, that I think will make work more fulfilling for people, make it more productive for companies, and that will actually have a lift to the economy itself. It has been in the top five for three years running. What I think people can take away from a workshop are the specific, actionable, hands-on, roll-up-your-sleeves ideas for how to put this in place in your organization. As a writer, it hurts my feelings a little bit to say that books are inadequate. But I think for HR practitioners who want to lead a broader transformation of the workplace, they need a different kind of tool. And that tool, I think, is getting in with some smart people, going through a set of exercises, and leaving with an action plan, I think can be really, really powerful. It's hard to transform a workplace unless you get at the root question of what really motivates people in that workplace. And if we take a new approach to understanding that question and come up with a whole bunch of tools and, and action plans to allow people to operate differently, I think we have a really fighting chance to make work and jobs that are more fulfilling and companies that work better. And so I'm excited about the possibilities of putting these ideas into action.